Hi everyone. I hope everyone is doing well and staying healthy. So today I just want to talk about getting older and what I think about it, how I deal with it. I'm sure for a lot of people, uh, they're probably wondering why, why make a big deal out of it. I, I, I never really made a big deal about getting older. I remember even when I turned 40, I didn't think it was a big deal. I thought it was just another birthday. When I turned 30, it was no big deal. But something about turning 46. So I turned 46 last December, 2021. And for some reason, when, I, when my birthday hit that, that day, it just, it hit me in a whole different way. I think it's just, maybe the the fact that i'm four years to 50 that may have kind of <laughs> freaked me out i'm sorry for anyone in their 50s this is not i'm, I'm sorry it, there, there's nothing wrong with with being in your 50s but like i said my mindset is very young i feel like i'm still in in my 20s <laughs> I have, i'm pretty immature for my age so Something like that, I feel like almost um, trapped in my own body because I, I just don't feel 46. And I'm sure I don't look it. I mean, a lot of people, I, no one at work knows my age. I, I don't discuss my age. And they all think I'm in my early 30s or even late 20s. So, you know, that's something I'm very grateful for and I'm very fortunate about. And I really don't have a, a secret. I don't use expensive skincare. I don't eat super clean, but two things that I do do is that I work out religiously. I work out six days a week, and I always um, take in five servings of fruits and vegetables every day. So that may be it, but other than that, I really, I've never had plastic surgery. It's, um, like I said, I'm very fortunate. I'm wearing, obviously, makeup, but without it, I, I look even younger. So this is not, I'm not talking about getting older to complain about getting older. It's really not that. I think I'm just going through a midlife crisis right now. And um, that midlife crisis usually hits around this age, right? In, in, in mid 40s to late 40s. So maybe that may be it. I may be in the onset of menopause, who knows? <laughs> but I just wanna, I wanna talk about it and I, I I don't like t talking about it with people because I try, try to keep my age a secret. I mean, obviously my friends know how old I am, but my coworkers don't and I spend more time at work than anywhere else and I don't really, really don't wanna talk about that with them. So I'll talk about it with you guys. I think a lot of it also has to do with being a woman. I think women are more affected by getting older than men are. It's, it's very unfortunate, but it, it is what it is. But it's, um, like I said, it's something, uh, midlife crisis is not permanent. It, it goes away. So I'm sure over time, I'll just, you know, learn to accept it and, and be happy with, with getting older and accept it, you know, gra graciously. But, um, you know, I just want to talk about it with you guys. Uh, but I am very grateful for my life. I feel like um, a lot of good things has happened to me. I'm just, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm a very simple person. I'm not, I'm not wealthy. I don't really have super expensive taste. And, you know, I'm very happy with the small things in life. I'm very grateful to just be alive, to be healthy. And uh, yeah, so that's, that's um, pretty much it. I think I just want to get this off my chest and, and prepare myself, I guess, to getting older. <laughs> And, but I want to hear from you guys, um, for, especially for people that are around my age or, or, or older, or, you know, in their forties, you know, how, what you, what you thought about getting older and how you dealt with it. It's a very short video. Um, I just want to thank everyone who clicked and, and joined in and I hope to hear from you guys. Bye.